Hey guys, it's again Astro One coming back at you with another Lego Iron 3 review. Now, um, the last one was the Extreme Seaport Battle, and today I'm doing the Iron Man vs. the Mandarin Ultimate Showdown. It has 91 pieces of uh, set 76008 and age 6012. Uh, this is for the Lego Marvel Superheroes line. Uh, it costs about $31. For your can, it costs like 15 or at uh, Toys R Us, costing like twenty bucks, which uh, I would recommend for Toys R Us. Now, uh, now uh, this is basically a, like a little place for like five year olds, like a five year old could build it. Uh, because like it's just like a little dragster, which isn't that uh, all that good, but um, you know what I mean. Um, mainly the reason I got this set was for the. Uh, uh, heartbreaker suit, cause look at that suit, it's a boss. I mean, who would've want a heartbreaker suit? I mean, it's a Mandarin heartbreaker suit. Who who would, who doesn't want one? But anyway, um, uh, oh, I'm sorry for the lack of videos. I've been very busy. Oh, like, tomorrow I might be doing an update video on, like, what's been going on, like you guys know. Um, uh, like, I've been getting mainly a lot of new sets. Saturday, I was just to uh, take a trip to Toys R Us or something like that. But I'm going to be getting a lot of sets soon. Many, many sets I've been getting. This is one of the newer sets I got. So, um, anyway, let's start off with the box. Has uh, already right in the corner. It's a little seed. There's all the details. And the back. So now, uh, let me just show you the manual very quickly. Let's put that back there. This has about thirty-one pages of building. There's the pieces. Uh, the new game coming out, and back, best, max try out Armin's. Uh, you know, suit or whatever. And that kid screaming in the background, which is can never go to get a load of him. Let's just put it, put it over there. Yeah, let's put it over there. Now, let's start off with the figures. First off, let's start with the best mini figure of the set. It, it, and, in other cases, the leader of the Iron Legion. The Heartbreakers. The Heartbreaker suit. Now, this is a very boss suit. One of my favorite suits that I have ever had. And one of my only suits that I have ever had. One of my only, uh, I also have like seven more suits um anyway um he's like uh he has those blue studs there and show off that he's like in the air those legs has some silver gold and red printing then the middle is the is what they call the heart and heartbreaker suit because because um it's like in the middle and left like what it shoots out at the middle like the main energy source and there's the back and the top is pretty different compared to a normal Iron Man minifigure. Or like a different one. So you can see, Heartbreaker has blue eyes, and this one has white. Oh, it has some more red going down. Bottom has some silver and some red. And this one has just plain red and gold. So, uh, Heartbreaker has a lot more details on it. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, my phone just dropped. Okay. Uh, I usually um, do my videos with my camera, but today I'm doing it with a phone. But so sorry about that, guys. Uh, but uh, the bath, this mask is a lot, heck of a lot better. This is the face. Oh, he's angry. And the back, he's like happy. Or he's like smiling. But um, that's the heartbreaker, too. But I'm so sorry my phone dropped. <laughs> but, uh, don't worry. Uh, next is the Mandarin. Now, he is... He is worse than the Malibu Mansion one. I got... I got the actual proof. Got the second one right here. Let's put it right there. As you can see, there's a heck of a lot different. A uh, beard, a uh, face, and slick back hair is the same thing. Um, legs, a little different. 
uh, Mandarin's, uh, the Mandarin to the right has more printing. The back of this one only has bullets and a bandana going around. And this one only has like some printing on the back. Uh, this one has a cape, the other one doesn't. This one has, um, they both have the same back faces as well. Oh, let me show you the back face for this one. That's the back face. And, um, this one has the, um, let me show you. I have to take apart Mandarin to show you guys. Now, as you can see, this one has just some bullets and a bandana. The other one has, like, a, the heartbreaker. Like, the heartbreaker, so it looks the same thing. But, uh, as, you, as you can see, um, you probably know by now that, that, like, probably everyone I, everyone I know that likes Legos likes, uh, this Mandarin better. Or, like, a lot of people I know from the internet or Google or whatever. Like, a lot of people like that one better. Well, uh, to be honest, people like the Alabama Mansion one better, so, and so do I. Uh, let's just get on to the, uh, Dragster. Or whatever. This weird Dragster has nothing to do with an Ultimate Showdown. Just some yellow, uh, wheels. Or it's just like a shield or whatever, some green. Put Mander inside. This side he can hold his gun. The back is pretty cool. Just some lights, and up here, just like some missiles or whatever. This little pipe that goes up here, and those flick fire missiles, never get a load of those. And some fire, which is like a flamethrower, and this, which it could come handy. You put that up like this, and you can also move this. So uh, basically, yeah, that's that's it for the review. Uh, tomorrow I will post the update video why I have been lacking video so much. Uh, but uh, I'll explain that in my update tomorrow. I'll be showing you guys the new sets I've been getting, like what I'm going to be working on. So I'm going to start, um, I'm going to finish building my set for the um, stop motion I'm going to make. Um, I'm not telling you guys what it's about, but it's so, that's something to do with Iron Man. Yeah, so yeah. I'm just asking you guys, um, can you guess what it is? Um. It's something pretty cool, though. Um, animation for the movie has something to do with in the movie. But, um, yeah. It's not a battle or anything. But, um, I guess I'll show you. Uh, you're just gonna have to watch it to find out. So, anyway, uh, see you guys later. Stay tuned for the video tomorrow. See you guys later. Bye.